what's happening internet and youtubers got a call from a young lady today down in jacksonville florida going to truck driving school she said she, she feel like the instructor is singling her out and picking on her and saying that maybe she shouldn't be a truck driver because it's taking her so long to catch on she's having a lot of trouble backing up and he's rushing her and everything and so i was telling her make sure that she's not taking all that negativity personally and that you know she's going to encounter a lot of these poor atti uh, bad attitudes out on the road at some point might be the shipper receiver the dispatch so one way to look at it is that you're getting additional training beyond the the training for getting your cdls which is going to prepare you for those ill attitudes so make it a project in which you um see how how good you can deal with it you know and not let it bother you and that probably the only problem the probably the biggest reason that's taking so long for uh, for her to catch on is because when she's getting ready to perform she's thinking about what he's going to say and trying to keep him from um, chastising and everything I told her don't don't let that bother you and focus on just driving because if you keep on worrying about what he's going to say then that's going to keep you from uh, concentrating on what it is you're trying to do you just keep end up doing the same thing each time you get behind the wheel because you don't remember what you did last time you don't know how to change it up and um, improve because you're worried about the clown so don't let what the clown's saying be a self-fulfilling prophecy because you're absorbing it and, and internalizing it and taking it personally this is just somebody who needs an attitude adjustment and don't know how to deal with people. So when you look at it that way from a big picture perspective and you um, you realize that just because what that person feels about your skills and ability is not um, what you want to hear, don't let it make your performance equal up to what that person is saying because that's that can easily happen that's what happened to happens to us in life a lot um we basically find ourselves living up or i should say living down to someone else's expectations of us and we have to be on guard on guard for that and be more, more mindful that regardless of what other people feel about us you know we have the same potential as anybody else and a lot of times the only thing that's 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 making it look like um we got more issues than we do is because we allow what other people are saying uh, get into our minds too much and it's holding us back so i'm repeating myself <laughs> but the point is it's getting hot in here too the point is just um let it blow over your head she was doing great because she 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 did not stoop down to his level of ignorance and because of course if you go back and forth tit for tat uh you know it's, it's always a person in the position of leverage usually that's going to have an attitude problem like that so it does absolutely no good um losing control which she never did lose control and we're going to get back I'm, i didn't think about it then um, we're going to touch back bases with her later and see how this thing turned out. I'm expecting her to pass with flying colors, get on track. She sounded real good by the time we got off the phone. So I think, you know, she, she kind of took to heart some of what I was saying and that um, she got a better perspective on it. I think I, I could tell that she was frustrated and I believe that she, it was getting to the point where what she was talking about, she was thinking about quitting. I think she was getting to the point where she was wondering if he was right and that's nothing but his words getting into her head but um just to prove what type of a person she is she said that um some material that they passed out she didn't feel was adequate for a, a test that they was preparing for she went online found more documentation that that she felt was was better and made enough copies for all of the other students in the room and just gave it to him so he might be 
you know so she has that leadership quality and that might show in other at other times i don't know she didn't say anything about any other incidents but you know some people see that see something like that and they feel threatened they, they feel like their authority is threatened and so that might be the cause behind it but it doesn't matter you got to figure out how to deal with it not let it bother you and move forward you know so what's the lesson for you <laughs> i said it three times deal with it stay positive don't stoop to the level of forward, i mean uh negativity a uh, level of ignorance just move forward get what you can out of it as I always use stuff like that as an opportunity to you know work on my own self-control that's what i that's what i do in cases like that use it as an opportunity to work on my self-control and that's what you can do too remember there's always a lesson to get out of the worst challenges in life and these challenges is what makes life interesting it's an adventure hey thank y'all for watching we're gonna get back and see what happened with her and this truck driving school peace